Hi, this is Laurel, the Blissed Out Chef. Tomorrow um, is the beginning of the Jewish New Year, Rosh Hashanah. So, um, what? No, no holiday is complete without Grandma's chicken soup. And um, there's, there she is, right there, Bessie Friedman. This is a recipe from my book. I'm missing one or two of the ingredients. I just didn't get them, but that's not going to compromise the taste of this soup. Um, and plus, she's joining me today, so um, the soup's going to taste even better. So what we start out with, and I already have some in the pot, is kosher chicken. Um, now the thing about kosher chicken, it's soaked and salted. Um, a kosher chicken has no diseased parts in it. It's absolutely perfect. Um, and the taste from a kosher chicken in a soup, there's nothing that compares to it. It's absolutely amazing. So we're going to put some of this in the pot. And the other thing that I use is I use a whole onion. I use a whole onion because we're going to scoop this out later cut up celery, carrots, about this length. I'm gonna grab another one here for you. Like that, maybe a little bit longer, because what's gonna end up happening is we're gonna have a clear broth, like a consomme. So we're just gonna throw all this in the pot. Now the water I use is really important. I use um, reverse osmosis water in everything I drink and cook with. It's clean, and you just cover, cover, cover the soup pot, now the way we always get it, that's enough water, exactly enough water. It covers the chicken an inch or so above the chicken. You don't want too much more than that. It's going to extract all that lovely flavor out of it. And we're going to get back to you when this is done, and I'm going to show you what it looks like. What's going to happen when this finish cook, when finishes cooking is I'm going to cool it down, refrigerate it. All that fat's going to come to the top. We skim the fat off, and what we have is a beautiful, clear broth. So. Join me when this is done. And this is the Blissed Out Chef, and we will see you back in a little while. Bye.